Welcome to Royal News Updates. ONG. Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall's health is not good. Please pray for Camilla. Before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, dismissed health concerns as she joined her husband, Prince Charles, on a four-day tour across Northern Ireland and the Republic of Ireland. Camilla and Prince Charles made royal history by becoming today the first members of the firm to visit Cookstown, a small town in country Tyrone, Northern Ireland. There, they were welcomed by hundreds of royal fans and schoolchildren, waving the Union Jack. The Duchess of Cornwall appeared in good health and high spirits as she stopped to speak with some of the well-wishers. The first stop of the whirlwind tour saw Camilla and Charles visiting Superstars Café, a centre helping to train and provide employment for 20 young people with learning difficulties. There, the future King and Queen consort met staff, volunteers and trainees and were shown some of the work carried out by the youngsters. Moreover, Charles and Camilla were quick to jump on a twin bike at the centre, leaving bystanders amused. The visit to the cafe ended after the royals unveiled a plaque marking their passing. Charles and Camilla's tour on the island of Ireland is one of the four foreign visits being undertaken by senior royals within just a few weeks. Kate, Duchess of Cambridge and Prince William are currently preparing to start their visit to Jamaica after touring Belize. Next month, Prince Anne will head to Papua New Guinea while Sophie, Countess of Wessex and Prince Edward will visit more Caribbean nations. The visit to Northern Ireland comes almost one week after Camilla pulled out of a planned trip to Cheltenham, sparking concerns for her well-being. The Duchess was due to present the trophy to the winners of the Queen Mother Champion Chase last Wednesday. It is understood that the cancellation was due to Camilla trying to pace herself after healing from a bout of COVID-19. Reporting Camilla's decision to cancel her attendance from the beloved horse racing festival, the Daily Express Royal correspondent Richard Palmer wrote on Twitter the Duchess of Cornwall had been due to attend Cheltenham Festival today, but she has pulled out. It's understood she is trying to pace herself as she recovers from the bout of COVID-19 she had last month. Mr Palmer, referring to a visit undertaken by the Royals on March 15th, added, She had looked as if she was struggling at an engagement yesterday. The Daily Mail Royal Editor, Rebecca English, also spoke about Camilla's possible health woes. She tweeted after it came to light the Cheltenham trip had been cancelled. She has been coughing a bit on recent engagements, I've noticed, and has said several times that she's struggling to entirely shake it off. Camilla contracted the virus in February, days after Clarence House announced Prince Charles had tested positive for COVID for the second time since the beginning of the pandemic. The Duchess herself revealed she was struggling to get rid of COVID symptoms during a meeting she hosted at her London residence to mark International Women's Day. While speaking with record-breaking rowers Kat Cordoner, Abby Johnston and Charlotte Irving, the Duchess said, It's taken three weeks and still can't get shot of it. Probably my voice might suddenly go and I might start coughing and spluttering. Charles and Camilla's visit to Northern Ireland also came one week after they took part in a lively engagement at the Irish Cultural Centre in Hammersmith, West London. There, as they marked the centre's 25th anniversary, the royals were involved in a number of cheerful activities. The couple joined in a band playing traditional Irish music and were shown how to play the Bodrum drum. Prince Charles was also given a crash course on how to pour the perfect pint of Guinness. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe share your to our channel. Comments.